there, Kevin Colby here. So let's say you've done an amazing, like an epic, an award-winning live stream, but you want to download it. How do you do that? I don't know. I mean, you could download it from YouTube and maybe even Facebook and, <laughs> well, let's admit it, good luck finding it on LinkedIn, right? But let me show you how easy it is to download it using StreamYard. So I'm in my StreamYard studio, my dashboard. Now yours will look just like mine, except it won't have my pretty face on yours, but maybe, maybe you think that's okay. So when you get here, you basically have two tabs. You have upcoming broadcast and past broadcast. Now, if you've already done your live stream and you've ended it, you wanna to go to past broadcast. Now in StreamYard, you have 15 days. So what I would recommend is as soon as your live stream is over, go ahead and download it and don't worry about later. Did I do that? So here's one I did not too long ago. You wanna click on the three dots and you'll notice right there, now you can do a lot of things, but right now we're talking about downloading. When you hit download record, that's what you get. You can download the video and or the audio. I usually just do the video, then strip out the audio. You hit download and it'll start. And wherever you wanna save it, you save it there. Depending on how long it takes or how long your, your length of the video is, the live stream, it may take a little bit longer to download and then you're golden. Now make sure you check out StreamYard for yourself to see how easy it is to live stream and download your video. And by the way, I appreciate StreamYard for sponsoring this video. There's a link down in the description. You can try StreamYard for free. Hey, I hope this helped you out. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.